Keegan's kitchen. This is the sorrel farm right now. It's eat sorrel season, so we are do some sorrel picking real quick. Make some sorrel drinks and them thing there. You know? Yeah, man, so you just want to cut the stem off it and just drop it in the bucket or the basket, whatever you have. This is beautiful, guys. Look. Look at all this. Nice. Mm -hmm. This whole farm right here probably could make you like maybe 10 or more gallons of um, sorrel. You know, so a good amount. More than 10 gallons. So. This is the sorrel farm right now. Uh, this is what it looks like, guys, close up. Yeah. So when you cut it off, it bear more crop again yeah, next year? Yeah, it's going to be on next time again, before you plant back the seeds them. Oh. So that's why you don't have to cut, you know, cut on the plants. Oh. Yeah. You hear that guys? So when you remove the sorrel from the tree, don't kill the tree because you can get another season from it. And then after the second season, you can plant your seed, replant your seed, you know? Yeah. Okay guys, so this is how you remove the seeds from the flower. This is like a broken uh, umbrella stick. Pretty easy to use. It's just an easier way to do it. Or you could basically just pull away the leaves like this, the flowers. See? But when you do it this way, you're wasting a lot of the actual flower. Versus doing it this way, take the seed out, and you know you get to keep most of the flower. So that's how I do it. <laughs> 